Japan's original programs for the Posky of Poland was first, Jumanov for the Soviet Union second, and Kakiyama Japan third. On the ice right now is Alexei Umanov. It wasn't too many months ago, I would say, he was from Leningrad. Now we say he is from St. Petersburg. Impressive year, third in the Trophy La Ligue. And he has landed a quad in competition. This is the free skating section of the competition, which accounts for 66% of the overall score. Now he will open up with a triple axle, three and a half times around in the air. Oh, beautiful. A young man only 18 years old. A point here for those of you watching the competition, we showed you that Masakazu Kakiyama was third after the original program. Masakazu has already skated. We're not sure that he skated well enough to hold that position. We'll let you know at the end of all the competition. Alexi was second in the World Junior Championships. And I think we all know that the best Soviet skater of all time, singles, is Viktor Petrenko. Scheduled to be here, injured, and is not here. The Soviet Union has not been known for its depth in male figure skating. It's always been in ice dancing and pair skating. However, with folks like Petrenko and this young man, the trend is changing. Alexi's second after the original program. The question, Peter, is he skating well enough to hold on to that spot? Alexi Romanov of St. Petersburg. This is the final night of the 1991 NHK Championships, and it is the men's night on ice. Oh, a little oh. trip there. Got it right back, though. Did a nice triple flip. I've got to be honest with you, though, Peter. Alexi doesn't look as though he has flair. I guess in show business, he lacks pizzazz, <laughs> in my opinion. Well, there was a triple loop. Well done. I think what we're seeing is the fact that he moved up from the junior category into the senior category. He may be a little lackluster because he's not sure of what he's doing yet. With experience, I think more excitement will come into his skating. Oh, darn it. You know, He's an unusually tall person for figure skating. Most of the guys are a lot shorter, so someone that's tall, there's a lot more can go wrong. And 
and it's sometimes more difficult to rotate. But good experience for Alexei Ermanov, who still has a great chance for a medal here in the NHK Trophy. We'll have more men's figure skating in a moment, and we'll have Alexei scores in a moment. You're watching the NHK Trophy from Hiroshima, Japan, on U.S. Olympic gold. We are back in Hiroshima.